We are the ones we've been waiting for. We are the change that we seek. The future rewards those who press on. I don't have time to feel sorry for myself. I don't have time to complain. I'm going to press on. The best way to not feel hopeless is to get up and do something. Don't wait for good things to happen to you. If you go out and make some good things happen, you will fill the world with hope. You will fill yourself with hope. In the face of impossible odds, people who love this country can change it. Change is the effort of committed citizens who hitch their wagons to something bigger than themselves. When times get tough, we don't give up, we get up. The cynics may be the loudest voices, but I promise you, they will accomplish the least. There's no progress unless people shoulder the burdens of a new age. The future is not a gift. It is an achievement. Change is never easy, but always possible. The best way to predict your future is to create it. We don't ask you to believe in our ability to bring change. Rather, we ask you to believe in yours. Where we are met with cynicism, and doubt, and those who tell us that we can't, we will respond with that timeless creed that sums up the spirits of a people. Yes, we can. The true test of the American ideal is whether we're able to recognize our failings and then rise together to meet the challenges of our time. In a world of complex threats, our security and leadership depend on all elements of our power including strong and principled diplomacy. There's no such thing as a lost cause because there is no such thing as a one-size-fits-all future. Making your mark on the world is hard. If it were easy, everybody would do it. But it's not. It takes patience, it takes commitment, and it comes with plenty of failure along the way. The future belongs to young people with an education and the imagination to create. In the unlikely story that is America, there has never been anything false about hope. If you work hard and meet your responsibilities, you can get ahead, no matter where you come from, what you look like or who you love. Focusing your life solely on making the buck shows a certain poverty of ambition. It asks too little of yourself, because it's only when you hitch your wagon to something larger than yourself that you realize your true potential. We should do everything we can to ensure that all of our kids have the opportunity to achieve their dreams. Success is not about how much money you make, it's about the difference you make in people's lives. The best way to find yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others. The future is what we make it. And, let's face it, we've got big challenges ahead. No matter how dark the moment, love and hope are always possible. If you're walking down the right path and you're willing to keep walking, eventually you'll make progress. We need to internalize this idea of excellence. Not many folks spend a lot of time trying to be excellent. America is not the project of any one person. The single most powerful word in our democracy is the word, we the people, we shall overcome. The future doesn't belong to the faint-hearted, it belongs to the brave. <laughs>